In this video, I will show you guys how to upload a video to Google Drive and also how to share that video with other people. So with that being said, let's jump straight into the tutorial and the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your Google Drive. So you wanna make sure you're logged into your correct Google account. So if you look in the top right hand corner, you can see I'm currently logged into my digital tutor account. From here, what you wanna do is come to the address bar and type the following, which is drive.google com hit enter and that's going to take you across to your google drive so from here the first thing you're going to want to do is upload your video so in order to do this all you want to do is come up to the top left hand corner and click this button which says new and then you want to select file upload from here just go ahead and locate the video you want to upload using windows explorer and i'm going to use this as an example it's just an old tutorial video that i did and what you see down in the bottom right, this has started uploading. So it's gonna give us a rough approximation of how long this is gonna take. Of course, the bigger the file, the longer it's gonna take. Because it's only a couple of minutes long, it's only gonna take a minute or two, and you can see the progress bar going round down here in the bottom right hand corner. So once that's finished downloading, I will come back and show you guys how to go ahead and share this with other people. Okay, so the file has actually finished downloading. You can see down here in the bottom right hand corner, it says one upload complete. So what we're now going to do is locate this file in our drive. So I'm just going to scroll down and we can see the file is here. So what you're going to want to do is click onto the file and it's going to bring up some details on the right hand side. Next, what you're going to want to do is just scroll down until you get to this section here, which says who has access. And at the moment, you can see it says private to you, which means that currently only I have access to this file. To change this, all you want to do is click the manage access button underneath. And what it's going to do is it's going to load up another window. And what you can do is actually add people to send this to. So for example, I can send this to another one of my emails and just send a message saying like, hey, here's that video. And then simply go ahead and click send. And what that's going to do is send an email to this person with a link to the video. We're now going to go and click the manage access button again, because what you can also do as well, if you want to share this with more people, then if you come down to this general access section down here, click on the drop down box and change this to anyone with the link. And then what you can do is click this copy link button down here and then just send this to whoever you want. So if I come up to the address bar and hit control V, you'll see this is the direct link to that video. And because it's been changed to public general access, anyone that has that link can now view the video. So I hope this video helped you out today. And if it did, I'd really appreciate if you did leave a like on the video and make sure you do subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with the latest tips and tricks for everything tech and digital related. With that being said, I just want to take a moment to thank you for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next tutorial.